Hi guys, you are watching Ask NG with AJ. I am an MPI. The thing is that most of you are a lot confused whether I would get an NIT with the NTA score which I am provided with. So the thing is that first you should relax. The thing is that you can't tell the rank of a person just by evaluating his percentile. So many videos are releasing that you can calculate your rank from your percentile. And some of them are so much bullshit that they are saying we can calculate our score from our percentile. We had released one video regarding how to calculate your percentile from your score. The thing is that the percentile and scores are not at all related. The percentile have direct link with your rank on the shift which you wrote the exam. So if you haven't watched that video, watch it. The link is given. So the question, the biggest question in India now is what is the minimum percentile required to enter at least a single seat in an IT? So we are going a little bit mathematical and also this result is not accurate but it is an approximation. We can think like the top students who got higher ranks in J in 2019 January exam and April exam will go to IIT. So the first 10,000 students will go to IIT as there are 10,000 seats in IIT. And after those 10,000 ranks, there exist almost 17,000 seats in NIT. So we can say that about 28,000 rank we can get into an NIT. So this is just an approximation. We can get into an NIT if our rank is about 28,000. I repeat it's 28,000 but you will be asking I said previously that we can't calculate our rank from our percentile but what we can do is that we can take an analysis of previous years and and I can say that almost 12 lakh 50,000 students will appear for the April exam so by taking the 12 lakh 50,000 students and using mathematical calculation I will say that almost it's not for sure about 97 percent the students who got 97 percent still have a chance to get into an NIT this is just an approximation there may be variation of two percentile either above or below that's for sure i am saying about general category for sc st and obc that's not sure i think for obc 90 percent will work and SC and ST 85% I am not sure about these things but I am just saying this with mathematical calculation so I hope you guys understand what I tried to say so thanks for watching this video like share and comment subscribe to our channel ask ng with AJ for such freshly new thoughts regarding JE and other competitive exams till then bye